Okay, so when I first started playing this game, this is Golden Sun The Lost Age, I started playing it on an emulator for my iPhone called GBA for iOS. And everything was fine and dandy until you get to some one of the earlier parts in the game, um, the Deccan Plateau. Um, and there's this part where you're chasing a djinn and you're supposed to see push this pillar down right here and then you're supposed to climb down the pillar. Well, the emulator gets stuck and you can't climb down. And so that sucks because you can't, you know, progress the game. And so I started googling things and I found out this is actually a really common problem for the emulator. And after some trial and error, I think I found a way around it. So I'm going to show you how to do that. So I'm just going to use retreat to get back to the main screen. And then go through the plateau like you would normally, you know, fall down in the cave, whatnot, do all this. Hop across here and then go down. And then when you get to these cracked platforms, you need to go fall through a platform and go into the cave. Then go up and around. You can go get that chest if you want. And then stop in the middle of this doorway and go into your synergy and waste all of Felix's synergy. So it's a good time to cure your party if you need to, you know, whatever. But you need to get Felix's synergy down to less than six. So I'm going to use move a couple times here. Just... Okay, and then when you're underneath the amount of synergy points that you need, it should be readed out. And then what you need to do is set it to a shortcut. So go in and set it to L or to R, you know, whichever one. And then try to cast Retreat. And it's going to tell you you don't have enough synergy points to do it, so just walk out of the cave. And then, would you look at that? We're back in the overworld. Congratulations, you've just skipped the entire plateau. Which is kind of a problem because you need that gin because he drops the pound cube and you need the pound cube for Felix to learn pound and you need pound to progress the game. So it's kind of a problem. So what we're going to do actually is go back to the Deacon Plateau and get the pound cube and the gin by working backwards. So just go um, back up and around. I'd recommend stopping at Madra first just because if you know your party happens to fall while you're in the plateau, it's going to send you all the way back to Dahlia, and that's going to be just a pain in the ass to get back. So, but if you stop at Madra, it'll just warp you back to Madra, and everything's cool. Okay, so you can go climb up the stairs and go to the left, and there's a little shortcut right here. You can push the pillar out of the way and climb up the vine, and it'll save you a couple screens. Um, just keep over to the left, and there's a little invisible area right over to Felix's left that when you walk into it, you'll activate a cutscene. See how the camera just jolted like that? What's supposed to be happening is you're supposed to see the djinn like, jump over and do a bunch of stuff. Now, I have my recording sped up by 500%, so it doesn't take that long, but in reality, this takes a really flippin' long time for this cutscene to play out. Like, the controls will lock up on your phone. There's really nothing that you can do. It takes about five or ten minutes. Just be patient. Go make a sandwich. Do something. But when the cutscene's over, you can just continue doing the Deacon Plateau like you would normally. Okay, and once you go around in the cave, you'll notice this doorway over here to the left is where you're supposed to come in if you're actually doing the plateau like the game wanted you to, you know, if you didn't have a bug on your emulator or anything like that. So just continue going across these cracks in the floor. Don't approach the djinn yet because he's just going to pound you in the floor and you're going to have to go back up and start all over and that's going to kind of suck. So just follow these cracks and then go down and around through the door to the south. Then go around this platform. You see a couple cracks. Make sure you get the one over to the right. This one, because you need to fall down on this crack right here. Because you'll fall on top of him and he'll drop the cube and that's the cube that you needed so desperately. So, yay! Pound cube. Okay, so I mean you can leave the plateau right now if you want, but I'd recommend going and getting the gin just because you know, it's it's a gin. And now that you have the pound cube, you can go over and pound this pillar. 
because if you approach him from the left without pounding it, he's just gonna jump across and laugh at you. So you can go and you can fight him and obtain him. Whoops, oh, <laughs> don't know what happened there. Okay. Guess I could just speed through this battle. Yep. Up, oh, Jen is down. Well, that sucks. And then you just go down and go to the right. Climb up the vine again and then go out that south door. And then you'll be back to the first screen that we entered the plateau from when we started going backwards. So, we'll go down around. Like, see, that's where we entered, right there. Then go down and out, and you're back in the overworld. Now, it's worth mentioning that when you go back over to the west, if you want to go back to um, Dahlia and the Kandorian Temple and everything that's over there, you can go backwards just fine. But when you come back to this side of the plateau, you're going to have to use that same glitch where you go into the cave with a chest in it and you waste all of your synergy and then stand in the doorway and try to cast retreat. And that should get you back out to the overworld. I hope this video was helpful to you, but if you're still having some trouble, there's something that I didn't explain well enough, just leave me a, com a question in the comment box below and I'll see what I can do to help you. Thanks for watching.